Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Akil and welcome back to another comic book collection update. And as you can see, <laughs> we have a lot here. So this just came today. Well, not all this. And I'll explain it right now because I got volume two like a couple of weeks ago, like a month ago or something like that. And I read it. I really enjoyed it. And as it turns out, I didn't realize this until recently when I was uh, ordering the rest of the set of the series, I would say, they were all from the same person. And what's funny is that, uh, the same person who I got, uh, volumes three to 12 of today, which just came just then, like not that long ago now, a couple minutes ago, basically, he was having one to 12. And I actually, uh, messaged him and said, can I just have three to 12? Because I already have one and two. And, he was generous and kind enough to actually say yes and he actually gave me the price and I paid it and pushing number two aside there's 10 here 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12 for 10 graphic novels $150 Australian dollars I should say because I live in Australia so if you do the math and divide it up $150 divided by 10 is 15 bucks 15 dollars for one graphic novel which is a lot cheaper than it is for a normal graphic novel actually which is great now to be fair these are old ones so there's that but still that's actually very good but putting this back here and i'm not going to take out one but still you just have to pretend and assume one's up here i have gotten half Oh, at least more than half of the series because this is not the entire series. Ultimate Spider-Man ends off in volume 22, Ultimatum, I believe. And then it goes on to Miles Morales, I believe, right? But anyway, the fact that I have at least a good chunk of the series is great. And I just was searching up stuff to get on eBay and I found this. I was like, you know what? I'm getting this. It's close by to me as well, where the person was selling it from. There was a bit of a delay. I didn't why, know why it took quite some time. Well, not that... I mean, it didn't get delayed, but it's like... You know when it says delivery? If you got an eBay, you know what I'm talking about. Like, it, it wasn't even, uh like, sent to the post office yet. So, I don't know why. But apparently, the guy was, like, working. And he said, oh, it was my day off. So, I'll send it, to, like, tomorrow or something. And sure enough, it came today. So, there you go. This, though, this took, like, two days to come. So, it was very fast. But this took a while. It's okay. At least I still got it. I mean, it did say... It'll, probably come like today or tomorrow or something but hey i got it so we're just gonna quickly go over this very quickly and then man i have a lot of reading to do and thank god i read volume 2 when i did and i enjoyed volume 2 so here we have volume 3 to 12 of ultimate spider-man so from this way we have volume 3 double trouble just a quick flick through volume 4 Legacy, Volume 5, Public Scrutiny, I'm very excited, ah, there we go, Venom, Volume 6 is just titled Venom, look at him, he looks great by the way, I think this might be also, uh, not inspired by, I should say the other way around, the Spider-Man PS2, uh, not PS2, Spider-Man 2 game for the PS5, I think might be inspired by this. I don't know. That's just a guess. I know nothing about it. I, I don't know why. Part of me thinks I might be. Like, maybe Harry becomes Venom. Who really knows? All right. Volume 7, Irresponsible with Storm. So that's interesting. And this, this covers, I don't know what it is. It's just great. And this is quite a thick book, actually. Where there's a lot going on here. Volume 8, Cats and Kings. So we have... Electra, I think. No, yeah, it is. sorry, it is. I when I saw that, I thought that was cause. I thought it was X twenty three, and then Black Cat. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. Now looking close up at it, it looks a little weird, but it's still pretty cool though. So we got some Marvel Knights action. This is also quite thick too. Volume nine, Ultimate six, and who is that? Is that why does who is that? I don't know who that is. That looks like Abomination. I'm not too sure. All right, Volume ten, Hollywood. Um. Yeah, volume 11, Carnage. Yeah. And volume 12, Superstars. 
with Spidey's friend, the Human Torch. And I don't know why I just stopped focusing. I don't know. Anyway, um, this is the entire collection. All right, now we're back. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, guys. I don't know what happened. I apologize if it was unfocused the entire time, too. But this is a lot of reading. And I'll put this up there, too. But, guys, wow. <laughs> I'm very happy right now. I mean, you could probably imagine why. Right? Getting this much in one day. I'm very, very lucky. Yeah. And this is not all I'm going to get. Because I'm planning next week to go with my friend to city. And I might get some more actually. So there's that. But not as much nearly as this obviously. Because I want to use my money for other things. But guys, this will definitely boost the upcoming graphic novel collection video that is coming in July. I always do them in July and this will be the second last one because I won't be on YouTube and won't be doing this forever. I actually plan to stop YouTube in 2027. So there's that. So it's only a couple more years and that'll be like the whole 10 year run since I've been doing YouTube in general. So I think that's enough. So there's that. But guys, that's it. A lot of reading for me to do. I'm very happy. Some great Spider-Man stuff that I'm sure I'm going to find in here. I mean, Void 1 and 2 were great, so we'll see what happens. But guys, that's it. That's all I have to say for now. What do you guys think about this uh, series overall? And what's your favorite, like, volume and story arc overall? As always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. My name's Akil, otherwise known as the Comic Director, and I'm signing out.